is a weird way to start my video, but look at this little, this little worm on my protein shake. It's so funny. Look how it moves. It's like, <laughs> I mean, I think it's an inchworm, right? It moves like a, like a cartoon or something. I don't know. It was making me laugh. I just thought I would start my video that way. All right, guys. Currently weighing in at 183 pounds. I don't know why I started with my weight. <laughs> just thought I'd give you an update on that. I didn't film myself this morning, so I guess that's it. Uh, usually I do like the morning weigh-in or whatever. Forgot to do it today. It's like 4 p.m. Had a productive day, you know, Instacarting, making, I made like 70 bucks. And now it's time to work out. So it's a uh, it's pull day. One of my favorite days, because I get a sick pump and I like to show it off. Because I think my back is one of my best features right now. It's like the only thing that makes me feel like I'm an actual muscular guy on here. Because like you see like people on like Instagram, YouTube all the time, they're freaking huge. I don't look anything like them. But sometimes if I flex just right, my back looks acceptable in that context. <laughs> so let's get a good back workout in. And um, I'm gonna try to uh, feel my lats today. As I, you know, I've tried to do that the past few back days. And uh, someone mentioned just doing lighter weight, seeing how that feels. I think I'm gonna give it a shot. Even though I've been doing like these heavier weight workouts, I don't think, I guess it's not really worth it for back because, um, you know, I still have trouble feeling that mind muscle connection. So I think I'll work on that today. And when I do have that, then I'll move up in weights. But I still have 10 minutes on this cardio machine, so just gonna try to get a little bit sweaty. Let's go. Yeah, my legs are dead right now. It's so bad that this is probably gonna hurt my quads as I do these. Or maybe it won't, because I said I was gonna do lighter weight. Never mind, scratch that. Um, so lighter weight for me on here is gonna be like 100 pounds. And I'm not even gonna worry about getting like the best back pump workout today. I'm only gonna worry about getting that mind-muscle connection going. And maybe at the end, if I'm feeling it, I'll just bust out a bunch of cheat reps. Um, but yeah, like I said, that tends to kill just my biceps and my triceps, not really my back. So even that would feel a bit pointless. Let's see how it goes. I'm trying to improve myself on this channel. This is something I need to improve on. Uh, it's not all about the gains, I guess. I need a, I mean, I guess this is about the gains, you know, having a mind-muscle connection. But uh, not every day is about gains, I guess. Okay, let's see here. My lat is connected to my hip up to my uh, mid-back area. Do I feel that? Here, let me, uh, let me reset here. Get a good stretch. Stretch them out and then just focus on my elbows. I'm trying to imagine what it would be like to do this without using my biceps. Like, what would that look like? I feel like it would just be like a shrug, you know? I mean, you have to use your bicep a little bit, it's inevitable, but if I can learn to relax it a little bit, and let my back tense up more, then that's all I'm really looking for. But I'm not really feeling that right now. 100% arms, even though I'm trying to focus on my, on my lats. I might feel it a little bit right there. I'm not really sure. I'm sorry guys, this is probably kind of boring. Um, my big aha moment is what I was hoping for, but I don't think it's gonna be that easy. <laughs> I might have to try this on a couple different machines today. Um, you know what, let's try upping the, the, the weight a little bit, see if that helps. It's nowhere near what I normally do still, so I think I'll be okay. Just checking out my form in the mirror.
I think I'll do a couple more reps here and uh, try out another machine too. Okay, I found something interesting. When I grab the pull down machine from right here, I feel it more. So nowhere near the handles. The handles are like way above my head. I'm like leaning forward and grabbing it. And uh, check this out. This movement right here. I definitely feel that on my back. So that's interesting. I wonder why that is. Like up here, it feels so bicep heavy and forearms. Right here, uh, I don't know if it's like, it's definitely heavier for some reason. I guess because it's closer to the, the center point of the machine. Um, so it feels heavier. I feel more tension. Uh, I don't have to bend my elbows as much. That might go into it. And it's giving me a bigger stretch because I'm leaning forward. So I'll keep that in mind. I think I'm uh, having a little bit of a breakthrough. <laughs> I don't know. All right, the rowing machine I wanted to use was taken up. So I'm just doing uh, inverted rows right here at the TRX machine. I think it'll, it'll be a similar thing. It's just that I'm using my body weight instead of uh, you know cables. So I kind of liked uh, how I had that weird grip on the, on the pull down machine. So, you know, one step closer to feeling my lats. And now I kind of just want to see how that feels, how this feels after I, you know, establish that mind-muscle connection. <sighs> yeah, like what if I flip my hands like this? Does that make a difference? But yeah, I'm just trying to notice like what I'm using for each of these exercises. Because I might just be overcompensating with my arms and stuff. All right, that was kind of abrupt, but I saw that the uh, seated row machine was available. And I haven't actually gotten to use this machine before. I don't know if it's new or if I just haven't noticed it before, but it was open and I took it. <laughs> so uh, I'm gonna try the same thing I was doing over there on here. So uh, let's go. Throw an arbitrary weight on there that I'll adjust if I have to. Honestly, this chest pad could be a little further back. That sloth arms, dude. Huh, probably further back, but I kind of like that. You know, I think I definitely prefer like keeping it close. For some reason, that feels a little bit better. Arms are burning bad again, so um, I don't know, man. That's all I got. It's it's not heavy weight. It's just like so. If I use heavy weight, I feel like it just tires out my arms, and then if I use light weight, kind of tires out my like forearms specifically. Like my my biceps are cool with the lighter weight. They're like whatever. There's nothing. But yeah, the forearms start giving out at the 20th rep. And if I do heavy weight, yeah, my biceps give out at like the eighth rep <laughs> before my back does. Um, so yeah, I think I'll just, I'll close out the back workout with a serious set on here. Just let my arms be tired, I guess. And then I'll do deadlift. I forgot I still got to do deadlift. <laughs> Deadlift should get like my lower mid back uh, pretty well. Usually does. Um, so 
So after this, I'm just gonna squeeze into whatever machine is available to get like my rear delts and my upper back. And then that'll be a day. I'm getting a little stressed out. It's getting like super busy in here. Like, and I let it get to five o'clock. So I'm kind of disappointed because on top of that, I didn't really find a good exercise um, where I have that like mind muscle connection with my lats. I mean, I think I learned a little bit uh, with the lighter weight, but not quite uh, what I was hoping for. Because my, yeah, like I was saying, my forearms just burnt out on like 20 reps with the lighter weight. And then, yeah, with heavy weight, it's just the same issue. So, I don't know. Arms either need to catch up or I'm just doing something wrong, like mind-muscle connection-wise. But, yeah, I got to do deadlifts. It's, it's getting late. That wasn't too bad. And I should probably put more weight on there because that's what I squatted yesterday. Uh, and I think you should deadlift a lot more than you could squat, so I'll up the weight. Legs are a little bit dead from yesterday too. That was a counterpoint, but I think I could do more, so I'll put more. All right, 265 on there. Not like the most impressive deadlift in the world, but a lot more than I was doing a few months ago. And uh, if you're just comparing yourself to yourself, then that's a big improvement. All right, 265, kind of took me to the limit there. <laughs> Seeing stars, dude. That's good, I like that. Uh, I'll do one more set, call it here. Probably won't film it because I'm definitely gonna need music for this one. And I can't film and listen to music at the same time because I'm using my phone. So I'll see you at my next exercise. I'll tell you how it went. All right, here's how it went. <laughs> I did like two more reps with music than without. It's crazy, like, what a difference, like, just bumping some... Whoa. Oh, that's fine. I thought it was going to fall. Hopefully that angle isn't weird. It might be better. But yeah, it's crazy how uh, much of a difference music makes. Just motivates me. I feel like I'm in a movie. So, yeah. Absolutely felt that in my lower mid-back. Uh, yeah, pretty good. Pretty good for my back, I guess. I don't know what to say. I'm not very eloquent right now. Or ever, really. Um, this is basically going to be my last exercise. I'm just going to work my rear delt so that my shoulders pop when I'm uh, big and strong. Not that I'm not now, I guess. <laughs> what am I talking about? Okay. Is that all it goes? It feels like it could... I don't know. Normally these are easier. I think I did more back work today than I thought I did. <sighs> That's good. Uh, this is pretty boring and it's very crowded in here. I'm a little bit stressed out and I don't know what to say. So I'll meet you guys in the locker room. Okay, there was too many people in the locker room um, and I don't want to be a weirdo. So I don't know, I'm gonna do something kind of equally as weird. <laughs> We're gonna do a parking light pose down while I have a pump. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, oh yeah. word like this? Nah, back was better. Okay. Keep popping. Um, <laughs> thanks for watching. I'll see you tomorrow. <laughs>